Okay, guys, we are back. Final Fantasy 16. What happened last time, what happened last time is we fought Harbord, stormed the castle, fight Harbord, take the crew there. We went there with Jill and we go and we fight Har Harbord. Awesome fight, absolutely epic fight. But then at the end of that fight, what happens is Barnabas shows up, right? The dominant of Odin shows up and he's like, meet me at the flagpole after school. And I'm like, what? And he one shots you, right? Completely rails you. Okay, boom, you're out of there. Goes, kidnaps Jill and they run off. So then you wake up in the hideaway and uh, you're recovering as Clive. Clive is recovering in the hideaway and he's trying to find out, or at this, you're at the point now where you don't really know the status of Jill, but you, uh, you have to go find her, right? So now we're, we're at the point where we don't have another icon battle or anything that happened in the last episode, but I'm assuming one's gonna happen uh, here today. I'm assuming with Odin, we'll see. Our goal for today is to go and go find Jill, go save Jill and we'll figure it out. So cool. If you guys like these videos, if you guys have been watching the Final Fantasy 16 playthrough, make sure to sub to the YouTube channel, like the videos, leave a comment, let me know what you think, let me know how you feel about it. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm really like, uh, I'm trying to do a lot of different stuff with my YouTube channel here, and maybe to the point of even making more YouTube channels and, and doing some different stuff here tr to try and figure everything out. But just give me all the feedback that you wanna give me, tell me what you think about the games, tell me, tell me what you, uh, think about the videos themselves. If you guys like something, if you guys don't like something, uh, I, I really want to hear everything. Okay, let's play. Hey, you like in the game? Love it. I left on accident though. How are we supposed to do our duty when Dude, the that, that annoyed God. me so much. Remember Fury? The people Fury? playing. Oh, oh, oh. Well, yeah, main quest, main quest, else. main quest. Don't tell me. They're all right. But it's a long story. You lot don't do things by halves, do you? Well, at least everyone's still breathing. Now. Nah. As for these writings, I'm sorry to say, Clive, but if you had those, you'd be... Sitting under a pile of rubble, I know. But we were able to save a few bits and pieces from the ruins, most of which ended up being used to build this place. The more personal items we gave to the next of kin. In the case of Sid's things, that would have been mid. <laughs> then I'll check the workshop. Like father, like daughter. Man, for real, for real, dog. Well, did you find anything? Possibly. You wouldn't happen to know what Mid's first opus was. Opus? That girl's as tone deaf as a banshee. Unless you mean the orchestrion. She couldn't have been more than what, 11, 12, when she cobbled that thing together? It surprised us all. Not least her dad. You should have seen how proud he was of the little scamp. What's that battered old box have to do with anything? I think Sid may have hidden something inside it. <laughs> Wouldn't surprise me. Those two and their bloody treasure hunts. Half the things in the hideaway were hidden one time or another. Carry looks badass, yeah. Yeah, Cl Clive is a badass character. I didn't break it. Well, I didn't break it. What didn't you break? Nothing. We didn't break nothing. We definitely didn't break the orchestra. Oh my gosh, dude. What's wrong with it? It's broken. Except when it isn't. It's like a vending machine. See? And you had nothing to do with this? Nope, nothing. We just wanted to listen to all the songs at once. So we press all the buttons. Like this. Inspecting, I'm inspecting. I thought he was gonna like ram it or something. The way he was like standing, I thought he was gonna ram it. Something caught on one of the gears. Did you break it? 
Can you fix it? Oh my gosh, Clive, you broke no, it. I mean, yeah, yes. There. How about now? You fixed it. Sid fixed it. He more than fixed it. Yeah, new music. Huh. Never heard this one before. They started playing when I removed this. Whatever it is. Well, don't look at me. I can tell you it's important, though. Sid showed it to me once and said as much. <laughs> said it was the stuff dreams were made of. <sighs> Let's just hope it's the stuff ships are made of as well. Indeed. Let's see if we can make some dreams come true. Okay. <laughs> the crack pipe. Um, okay. Black Blood and Gilbug. What's Gilbug? Small insect is not going to have its appearance, but rather than the fact it's highly sought after by physicers for use in brewing medicines. Okay. <laughs> Looks like a big spark plug. Yeah. Just the two I was looking for. Aye, aye. Who's a patient? Actually, yes. The Crown Prince just left. Get Should alive. we go after him? No. We're not the Prince's keepers. He's free to do as he sees fit. I'd rather he did so in bed. His wounds are nowhere near healed. Much like yours, I suspect. Otto told me what happened in Canver. What is it with this realm's princes and their aversion to rest? Uh, ask me when I get back. Though I may be some time. Then at least try to stay safe. But if that fails, try to stay alive, eh? Every moment I waste here, the further the flagship sails. I have to get back. Okay, so we gotta go to the ironworks. Okay, ready? Main quest. Clive, my dad had it all worked out. He'd be proud of you, Mid. His writings may have helped, but this achievement is all yours. <laughs> Can we catch them? The INAR is one of the largest, fastest vessels ever built. And it won't help she has the wind at her back. Any other ship would be hard pressed to keep pace with her, let alone reel her in. But this isn't any other ship. This is the Enterprise! And the world's never seen anything like my dad's engine. It certainly hasn't. What? Ugh. Clive. What do you know? This is main quest, yeah. Thumb? Only what the bards sing. And he sailed to ash from southern lands. That it was his mastery of the blade which won him the throne. And that his sword, Odin's sword, can sever the very threads of creation. But don't lose any sleep over a last tilt. We'll do what we must to survive. What we must. 
The light! I thought this cove was meant to be hidden! Mate! Company! Hey? We'll hold them off until the ship is ready! But hurry! Bullets! My name is Media. Everyone with me? <laughs> Here they come. Okay, here we go. Every moment we can give her. The whole uh, field was filled. I'll take care of these. Will of the Wike? Lightning Rod? Ignition? Gouge? Rising Flames? New enemies approach? Limit break. Nice. Extreme down thrust. Jump. Stomp. Boom. Combo. Nice. Magic burst. Then we're gonna go big gouge right here. Big gouge, big gouge, big gouge. Big gouge. Big ignition, hot and fresh out the kitchen. Deadly embrace. Roll the wikes. Lightning rod. Okay, that was weird. Deadly embrace. Lunge. Magic combo. Oh, precision dodge. Precision dodge times two? Oh my frick, dude, I just got railed. Will the likes? Let me break. Ignition. Lightning rod. Ah, oh, frick, I wasted my lightning rod. Big wind up. 30,000. I missed the lightning rod. Whoa, the likes. Into the limit break. Torgle, heal me, Torgle. Thank you, Torgle. Big Blind Justice, Deadly Embrace, turn. Blind Ignition, Big Gouge. Rising Flames into the windup. Boom, easy, easy. Nice. I love the play-by-play, -play. <laughs> thanks. That was easy enough. All right, you lousy lot. Get your asses on board. She's ready to sail. You heard the captain. <laughs> Clive? What the heck?
Confound it. Then it is as I feared. Sleipnir is no man, but a creation of Odin. <gasps> oh, frick. Phoenix's fiery fundament. Have you no normal enemies? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Up for another round? Of course we are. Right, Lord Rossfield? Oh boy, there was a time people called me the Executioner. The Executioner, Uncle Byron. No matter, heads will roll all the same. Heads roll. Mate, new plan. You leave, we follow. Follow? Swimming, are you? Oh, bother me. Lay anchor. Engine's dead slow ahead. Okay, my friends. Tis not okay, will of the like? Lightning rod. Ignition, round them all up. Good thing I brought one. How long are we meant to keep this up? As long as it takes. Wait, is this the freaking gauntlet, dude? Limit break. Deadly embrace. Okay, right, another ignition. Round them up. Made to be broken. Trophy earned. Sick. Rising flames. Phoenix ship. Semi prime finish. What do you mean semi prime? It's either prime or it's not prime. What does that mean? Double stomp. Down thrust. Phoenix shift again. Lunge, mortal blow, the execute. Roll the likes. Lightning rod. Bring them all in with a lightning rod. Easy. Football! I love football! Hell yeah. Right, run for it. Gav! Oh, frick, Uncle Byron, the executioner. Timing. Thanks for the prime, Beast Jr. The circling thing is Will of the Wikes. Oh no! <laughs> what if he misses? Falls in the rotating thing. Dies. <laughs> game over. <laughs> nice. The Naldia Nero. What do you want?
That's quite a mess you've made. And wholly unnecessary. You are my offering to Muthos. I would not see you damaged. So Jill is alive. Now back to your stations. It's Every good. Bell spent treading water puts another leak between us and the galleon. I don't suppose Mid has a spare engine. <laughs> Since you rose from the grave, my fortunes have plummeted. Are you absolutely certain of this quest of yours, Clive? The foes you face are as terrible as they are numerous. Aye, and they'd have us live and die on their terms, which should answer your question. You have that same stubborn look as your father did when he set his mind to something. On the battlefield, I am but a single axe. A deadly one, mind, but a single one nonetheless. Yet what you require is a thousand, and I believe my old friend in Brandalar can provide them. Take care, Clive. I have many more tales of your father's exploits to share. And I cannot very well do that if you're dead. Again. Good luck, Uncle. And may fair winds attend you. As for you, Joshua, take care. I shall do my best, Uncle. Farewell, my nephews. Bongo, Byron. When next you see me, it shall be with an army at my back. <laughs> death flag. <laughs> Uncle Byron just got death flag. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> So everything is a death flag. Do keep up, my boy. Well, we can't have him showing us up now, can we? We would never hear the end of it. What's up, Frag Monkey? Greek of mercy. And thanks, Haley Cat. Wait. Did he not die? Like, he, he died. Joshua saved him. Wait, medicine girl. My lord. Dude, this random medicine girl is just involved in everything. Was the hooded when man? When the ship heading north, asked around Zemeckis and put through the narrow. I think it was Ultima. Was the assumption? 
maintain our current bearing north northeast, and we'll catch the Black Galleon before she vanishes again. What's to prevent her from circling around Ash from the south? With these winds in those waters, it's taken forever and a fortnight to reach Stone here. Mid knows what she's talking about, Clive. Better than any of us lot, anyway. I say we do as she tells. Sails on the horizon. She's ours. So they're coming, they're coming up on Jill? Let's see what this girl can do. Wait, so ship battle? Do we have a ship battle coming up? It's Barnabas, it's Odin. Where one leads, so does the other fall. You know what I wonder? The bond of consciousness which joins oh, them, condemning both to the same fate. Yet my every attempt to strike it from their hearts serves only to tighten its hold. Fascinating. Oh, frick. Odin mode? Oh, frick. But then, there is naught my blade cannot sever. Heat wave, just block it. Great three goes gas! I feel like I'm taking up too much of the screen, dude. Okay, that's not good. Where did you hide, Barnabas? We have a commercial break time in a few minutes. After this combat, I'll do it. That's not good at all. Okay, so I'm on their ship, and Odin's on our ship. It should be timed. Yeah, that would be sick if it was. Okay, well, the likes. Lunge. Why does the game look so much better on S Fan Stream? Does it actually? I, I saw some people complaining that it looks different on my stream. You're the best stream. Other streams are a lot more blurry. 
Oh yeah, I uh, so I have like a lot of stuff with like encoding and like extra extra stuff that I've done to my stream in general. Uh, so it's probably that. Like as far as like blurry goes, that actually I totally believe that. It's not just bitrate. It's like uh, there's like some other stuff that I've done. Star Forge, yeah, but it's just in in. Oh my gosh, frick. In all honesty, uh, okay, I'm gonna limit. Okay, uh, this guy's freaking railing me, dude. This is actually a bad combo for me because I uh, I didn't really have a good. Okay. Imagine two hundred eighty-six thousand damage is bad. Precision dodge, nice. Precision dodge times two. Okay, roll the likes. Blind justice. Precision dodge times three. Lunge. Precision counter. Okay, this is a big damn right here. Ready? Lightning rod into ignition. Oh, frick. I thought he wasn't gonna move. Damn, I missed. Okay, gouge. It's still okay, I'm still gonna kill him here. The wind up! Right there. Easy. We ever do a tutorial on how to make your stream look that good? Because I feel like it looks better on stream than if I was playing my PS5. <laughs> Is it really? <laughs> Probably not whenever there's all, like a bunch of animation going on. Because there, there's some things that are like, in terms of bitrate, like... At some point, the bitrate is probably going to... Oh, yeah, yeah, I didn't do that, so... It looks better than the trailers, to be honest. It, that That is probably true. It probably does look better than the trailers on my stream. Watch more people play, it looks best so far. Well, that's not just because of how it looks, that's my gameplay that makes it look better, obviously, obviously. Yeah, I might not finish today. Maybe I'll finish tomorrow. We'll see. Alternative player, mass improvement. Really? Okay, here, let's just. Okay, we're gonna go blind justice right here. Roll the wikes. Lightning rod. Gouge. Ignition. Sure, you rap. Okay, we're gonna limit break. Roll 
all the wives right here. Big parry, lunge parry. Come on. Rising flames. Ignition. Lightning rod. Gouge. Oh, frick. I actually screwed up. Frick, man. That was so good. So. Roll the lights. Harry! Oh, dude, that's such a... Oh. That is such a clean parry, man. Big gouge right here. Big wind up this is the kill, 100%. Nice. The big down thrust. Cancel the cast. Boom, boom, boom. Nice. She must be here somewhere. There are many of us. Oh, here we go. Ignition. Double up, nice. Jill. You came. Get back. <sighs> Clive, how did you? I'll explain later. Hands. Hands! Let me see some hands! <laughs> can you walk? Out of here, I can. <laughs> And still! Phoenix. Are you not the dominant of fire? I see naught before me but a guttering flame. He's gonna blow up the ship, dude. Moses! <laughs> Moses! Wait. Wait, what? It stayed up? I thought I thought the water was gonna collapse on them. But 
To, to where? <gasps> Oh my gosh, dude. Dude, I was thinking about Leviathan too. That's what I was saying earlier. It's like, I wanted to say it, but I was in the middle of a cutscene. Like what if, what if, what if somebody is what Leviathan? You to Joshua? The Phoenix? Oh, I Cause this would be the time survive. that he shows up. This consciousness in which you coil your feeble souls is grown thick with desperation. And thus has my master turned to my blade. The world will soon be painted in black. And all that live shall gather in death's autumn wake. Not if we remove the cause of this misery. Not if we destroy the last of the Mother Crystals and restore balance to the world. Come. Do you truly think it's so simple? The Blight is inevitable. Not even the Almighty might stop its endless march. Your efforts will avail us naught. Naught, that is, but suffering. You must embrace the truth, Mythos. Accept your place with the Lord. Keep it. As long as there's a chance, there's a choice. Ever led astray by your blind resolve. It is time you learn the inevitability of your divine fate, however much it may hurt. Get as far away as you can. Clive, no! Trust me, Jill. Chat pop consumes. Porting all over the place. Was in dodge? Oh, but we do. If only to I'm gonna open with limit break. Will the wags? In a short time since our last meeting, you have grown much. It has a vessel. The Lord's measure? Precision dodge times two. Okay, I'm gonna ignition him. That's so. Ah, oh, damn! I was going. A foolish notion fed to you by a foolish man. How dare you! Oh, come on, that hit me at the edge of the hitbox. If our fates were so easily rewritten, we would all be gods. Nice! Oh, that was a beautiful parry, dude. Roll the likes into it. Ignition. Big gouge. Press the attack. If reason cannot sway you, there are Gung near. Break, man. Hey, are you good? Okay, it worked. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna go stone skin right here. Roll the wides, lightning rod. Okay, this is actually really bad, dude. Dude, I think this is really bad. 
I'm, I think I'm really behind on damage. Big wind up. You will assume the mantle you've been given. And thus is the light of hope severed. What? You would yield so soon. Never. Clive! Do you not see? How is Odin so powerful? Your iron will weighs you down, dragging you ever further from your purpose. And what is my purpose? Mythos. Who are we? What are the dominants? The breath of the Creator still warm on our lips. We carry his light that we might guide the masses in his name. We are but mighty acts of God. We are more than that! You would be nothing without what he has granted you. The power we wield is his, and yet every time we draw upon it, it wears away at our very being. It breaks us, it unmakes us, that its immaculate aspect might reveal itself. The Icon. It is too much for even his chosen few. Apart from you, Mythos. You wield the might of many, yet your body does not answer for its avarice. What are you saying? What I am saying... ...is that we dominance are a means to an end. We were created for you. That you might drink deep of our strength, and thereby fulfill your divine purpose. Which is... ...to feed. As you would know, could you only look beyond the walls of your prison of self-regard. As long as you choose to ignore this, you shall never penetrate my defenses. Still, you may take solace in the fact that you are not alone in your plight. The chains of volition shackle all of mankind, but there is yet cause to rejoice. For the Lord, in his mercy, has taken pity on his flawed creations, and shall see them restored to their proper forms. And what exactly would that be? Why, loyal servants to God. No. Manners, Lord Rossfield. They are men, like you and me. Albeit ones uh, unburdened by the wills that drive our kind to madness. They are pure. They are divine. You mean to turn everyone Akashic? Not turn, Mythos. Turn back. For too long has mankind been led astray by their clamorous wills. It is time they return to a world of quiet equality, where they might once more know salvation. Salvation? And abandon everything we hold dear! We don't need your... Salvation. We don't we'll save need save ourselves, your... and we'll do it on our own terms. Not yours, and not your gods. With every defiant expression of your will, the tighter the chains of consciousness become. But perhaps that fact may be put to use. The faster it binds you to the remaining dominance, 
the stronger your hunger will become. Until it leads you back to the only answer there ever was. Mayhap not by the path my master intended, but back all the same. Ash is not far. I could freeze a path. You're in no fit state. Probably not, but I can try. Tesla Tunnel. Don't look back. Live bested? Wait, what? Why are you besting Clive? Loser POV. Bro, really? Will of Light Impulse. Did I get bad ending? I hope the others are safe. The Enterprise was clear of the gap when we fell. They made it, Jill. And they would have seen the ice where it led. We need only wait till dawn. What the frick? This is the second time Barnabas has bested me. What? I'm powerless against him. And maybe there really is nothing else for it but to... Give yourself to his master. Chat, stop! Only you won't do that. The Clive I know would never do that. So you believe? But do you really know me? If what Barnabas said was true, then... I'm more monster than man. Each time I summon the flames from within, I burn away the things <clears throat> that make me who I am. Do you, though? Think of what you've used that power for, of all the people you've saved. It doesn't matter how or by whom it was granted, only how you choose to use it. chosen to use it for good, haven't you? I've also used it to kill. <laughs> what if that's my purpose? What if it's all I'm good for? That same boy I grew up with. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> always so eager to save everyone around you, and yet always so low. Because you failed to realize the one thing that needed saving most of all. You, Clive. You. You never once took the time to save yourself. Myself? <laughs> I think I might be beyond saving. No one is beyond saving, provided they want to be saved. You fight to survive. And you survive so that you may protect those you love. I'm about to bus. It's what you do. What you've always done. And I know you're not about to change. <clears throat> so I'm going to help you. To give you what you need to protect us all. If... 
If this is what you want, then... Don't worry, Clive. What? What is she... What is happening? It is. This burden... I'll give you the strength to bear it alone. What if she was like, that's not what I was talking about. Stop taking my powers. <laughs> What are, what are you doing? My, pain, my sorrow. She's like, I wanted to make out. I see now that they are all a part of me. Because it looks, the angle looks like it's hers, but it looked hairy. Find a way to save each other. That we might one day look upon the moon again, together. And I promise you, Clive, that I will be there no matter what you must become. I know. I never thought a smile could bring me so much joy. Looking at me, stop zooming in. <laughs> Go. <laughs> Is that what sex looks like? <laughs> so can I get you an Uber or something or <laughs> What of Barnabas? Do we pursue him? <laughs> no. Our paths will Stop again zooming! Why enough. does it zoom whenever I cover my face? Whether we like it or not. <laughs> Besides, there is something we must do first. Of course. Drake's spine. The last mother crystal. 
The Ein Herja is at the bottom of the sea. Walud won't dare move on Storm without her. But they know we're coming now. We'll need a plan. And a damn good one at that. Then let's go home and find one. <clears throat> Ash will have to wait. Okay. I don't even need to hear that to know what it said. Odin split the sea in two. She's always been partial to a tall tale. But there's tall, and then there's tall. I struggle to believe it myself. I see your uncle isn't with you. He stayed with the Enterprise. After our brush with the Einherja, she was in urgent need of repair. And my uncle knows a shipwright in Randalar. We're to join him there when we're ready to sail for Ash. You sure that's wise? Last I heard, the place was still overrun with a Kashyyyk. Show me a city where that isn't true. Ultima's plague is spreading. We're running out of time, aren't we? We've done our best to shore up that hideaway. But I doubt a few planks will stop what's coming. Still, we'll keep at it. Every little helps, I suppose. Let's hope so. The power of ice. Shiva's iconic feet, cold snap, can be used to move swiftly. I should Wait, so it's like a there. bonus dodge? Assuming Tony will allow it. Okay. So, okay, so we thought maybe we would get Shiva, but we thought when we got Shiva, we thought that we were going to kill her. Or not that we were gonna kill her, but we thought that, that Jill might die and that we take Shiva whenever Jill dies. But it seems like Jill's probably not going to die at this point. Unleash a, unleash a river of icicles that greatly knocks back any enemies it strikes. Wait, Wait that's sick. Mesmerize. Launch ultra shreds of ice that upon striking light enemies draw them towards Clive. Can be used midair. Rhyme. Oh my gosh, there's an ability called Rhyme? No way! There's an ability called Rhyme! Summon a colossal ice crystal that deals continuous damage to all enemies that are trapped inside of it. Dude, okay, we're getting Rhyme. We have to. We have to get Rhyme. Rhyme. Dude. Amazing. Yeah, I wonder, do we, do we replace Lightning Rod with Rhyme? Or do we stack lightning rom lightning <laughs> lightning rod with rhyme together and use them both? Okay, let's see. Man, but what do I use? Okay, I can't lose Will of the Wikes. I cannot lose Will of the Wikes. I can't really lose ignition. Gouge is is <sighs> gouge really instead of. Get rid of blind justice, you can't. No, it's all good to see you. How are you feeling, Joshua? Better than I was. But not nearly as well as you should be. Your cuts and burns may have healed, but your body still bears the burden of every spell cast. And what would you have had me do? It was no ordinary foe we faced. It was the Warden of Darkness. Yet still, it was not enough. The king could have ended me at any moment, but instead chose to toy with me like a curl does a mouse. Yeah. You underestimate yourself. Oh, it was crystal clear. Only one man established his dominance that day, and that man was Barnabas. I'm sorry, brother. That was ill-spoken. It's just... I have never felt so powerless, and when so many are looking to us for strength, perhaps... 
Uh, perhaps the prince feels the same. Yeah, once we were in the water, I really thought Leviathan was going to show up. But I, but I mean, I think if Leviathan hasn't shown up yet, he's not going to. I thought mid would be Leviathan. Mmm. What is this place? <gasps> Don't move. It's fresh from the well. Mother told me spirits sometimes get lost, and that the lanterns guide them to their proper place. I set one on the river for her when she passed away. Was it you who guided my hand then, Ultima? No, not you. This is my doing, my fault, my sin to bear. And for it, I must atone. Your hurts are healing nicely. It was my poultices that saw you well. You make them. And sell them, or try to. Earns me enough for bread, most days. Forgive me, I have nothing to. I know, but I couldn't just leave you lying there. <sighs> You're going then? Of course. I'm healed. Thanks to you and your poultices. How is Medicine Girl everywhere all the time? promised to come back and visit.
Perhaps he can find an answer. You will be returning to Walud soon, I gather. I see no reason to wait. Then neither do I. I can think of a few, but I doubt they'll stop you. You will take your medicine. Of course, Lady Tyre. Set on leaving already, are you? How long will it take us to get back to Ash? Dunno, about the same amount of time it took us to get here. Maybe less, if your uncle can find someone trustworthy to patch up the Enterprise. All depends on where we're putting into port, mind. Yes. It's not as if we can put ashore wherever we choose. We have to assume that the whole of Ash is hostile. And that we'll be attacked on sight. Then we must find a place they won't think to look. And I have an idea who might know of one. The Professor! I'll go and tell you come in! While you're plotting our course, I'll be in the shelves with your lawsmen. I wish to pick his brains about Ultima. Then I'll talk to Karen about supplies for the journey. They may not be easy to come by in Ash. Your brother's body won't take much more of this recklessness. You know that, don't you? I do. Ah, Clive. I was wondering when you'd arrive. Please tell me you've come to take our young prodigy here off my hands. I'm not here for mid. I need information on Ash. Then why not ask Molly if you can look in one of her ovens? <sighs> Go on. As soon as the Enterprise is ready, we'll be setting out for Drake's spine. And we're going to need a safe place to land. Preferably one that won't see my ship blown to shit and splinters. If it were that easy, do you think Walud would have resisted invasion for so long? Very little is known of Ash, and the information we do have is spotty and outdated. We have the good King Barnabas to thank for that. Walud's borders have been closed to outsiders since the day he seized the throne. If there is anywhere safe to land, you won't find it on my map. Then tell us what we will find. I'm sure you know better than we do. But no splinters! All right, all right, if it will get you out of my hair. But interrupt me, and it's over. Understood? Barnabas Tham, the one they call the Last King. Understand him, and you will understand the kingdom of Walud. Barnabas was only a boy when he arrived from beyond the southern seas, and barely a man before he united the ragged tribes of Ash. And having unleashed them upon the formidable Veldemark, he set his throne upon the ancient kingdom's ruins. The victory sent shockwaves around Valisthea, Tales of Odin's might spreading through every court, parlor, and drinking hall in the realm. Note that this was in the year 843, and that the king still sits upon his throne some 40 years later, quite untouched by time. Walud's recent inaction left many wondering if Odin had lost his appetite for war. And yet here we are. The Einherjar was committed to the fray, a bold declaration of intent. Orcs swarm around Drake's Fang, and throngs of Akashic haunt canvas streets. Though how precisely the havoc they wreak serves Walud remains unclear. Regardless, if the order to attack truly came from King Barnabas... I don't think Leviathan's in the game. ...then one thing is certain. Walud has achieved the impossible and made bedfellows of beast men and the ether adult alike. All of which is a roundabout way of saying that you will be in unknown territory when you set foot on Ash. Much of the continent has already been lost to the blight, and what few ports remain will be fiercely guarded. And that is to say naught of its natural defenses. Offshore currents will cast an ill-equipped ship out to sea one moment, 
and dash it against the rocks the next. But then the Enterprise is anything but ill-equipped. And Mid has made land there before. Now, if only there were someone with an intimate knowledge of the Shadow Coast, and where a daring gentleman might put ashore. You see, Clive, you had the answer all along. Do you think you can get us back to that beach, Mid? Picked you up from it, didn't I? Not that it were easy. The currents were right bastard. But then, if it wasn't hard, it wouldn't be worth doing, would it? Well said. Thank you, Lady Vivian. If a few morsels of common knowledge and a sprinkling of tavern talk are worthy of your thanks, I wonder what genuine intelligence might earn me. Probably more visits. Mid, I need everyone in the ale hall now. I'll fetch Joshua from the shelves. Aye, aye, Captain. Okay. How do you split the sea, you reckon? Covered in nicks and lumps, the lot of yeah, I thought I thought I saw art of Leviathan 2 on the banner. But I, I don't think I don't think Leviathan is in the game. Cause I, I just I mean maybe I'm wrong, but would he not would Leviathan not have shown up whenever they were in the water? I have no reason. What's the plan for game today? We're doing uh, 16, we have well, Cobra Sponsor. Clive. You must listen to this. Lorsman, tell him. Do you recall when we spoke before on the divinity of Ultima? Well, it inspired me to delve deeper into the subject. And what I discovered appears to agree with the findings of his grace. You will recall that my quest to uncover Ultima's origins began with the mural at Phoenix Gate. But while I've always known it to be important, its secrets have heretofore eluded me. Now, however, I believe I know where to find a more complete example. One that will reveal all we seek. Master Clive, have you ever in your travels chanced to hear of the Circle of Malleus? I would think not, few have. But there was once a time when the faith flourished, the oldest known religion in the Twins. And though its popularity eventually waned on storm, hints of its dogma remain embedded in more modern faiths such as the Crystalline Orthodox. Wait. You said it waned on storm. What of ash? Religious monuments are often torn down or repurposed when new faiths rise to prominence. But if no new faith arose, then perhaps the ancient temples might still stand. And so, you see now why I must accompany you to Walud. It would appear the past still has much to teach us. Though in this case, it would not have been possible without the musings of Moss. <laughs> to think that you carried a copy of my old mentor's chronicles all along. I am relieved to discover it in good hands. I shall guard it with my life. Joshua, if you're finished here, join me in the ale hall. I need to speak to everyone before we leave. Right away. Right away. Right away. <laughs> oh, oh well, I did. I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Cutscene again. My apologies. Wait By now you've all heard where we're going and why. So I won't bother you with the boring details, only the important ones. If we attempt to approach Stone here by sea, there's a good chance we'll be sighted and fall prey to the capital's artillery. So instead, we'll disembark on the southwest coast and make for Drake's spine on foot. I say we, but it's highly likely the entirety of Ash is under the rule of Ultima. A large party would only attract unwanted attention. As well as slow our march, 
and require supplies which may be difficult to obtain. Only Joshua and I will be going. And a scout. Preferably a good one. Gav, do you know of any? You bet your ass I do. <sighs> Might still borrow some of Lady Vivian's maps, though. Just in case, like. Once you've dropped us off at the Shadow Coast, you need to retreat into neutral waters, fly merchant colors, and stay inconspicuous. If you sense any danger at all, you leave us behind and return to Storm. Inconspicuous is my middle name. But like hell am I leaving anyone behind. The ship ain't going nowhere till your scurvy mugs are smiling on deck. Jill, the Enterprise will appear a tempting target for royalists and pirates alike. You're to stop anyone boarding. Don't worry. I'll keep the ship and her crew safe. You'll be needing passage home, after all. But... Very well. If there are no questions, I'll see you all at the docks. Let me know when you're leaving. I want a word before you go. Of course. Is something wrong? Not at all. Honestly. Can't a man wish his friend farewell? Just wanted to let you know that I'll keep things in order while you're off saving the world. I'll hold you to that. Shadow Coast. Shadow Moses. Reckon it'll be a long walk to the capital if we follow the cliffs. I'll scout ahead, see if I can't find us an inland route. Clive. Mm -hmm. There's something I've been meaning to ask. You took her icon, didn't you? <laughs> yes, I did. She understood. <laughs> oh, she understood. Understood that you decided to save the world all on your own, and that you'd die without her power. How dare you make her choose? You knew damn well she'd never refuse you. But I will. You can't keep pushing us away, Clive. The world is ours to save. Wait, not what? Yours. What the hell? I didn't get that vibe at all. I used my gift because I thought it was the right thing to do. And you truly believe this will save you? Will save us all? I do. Then so be it. Just don't forget, you're not alone. <sighs> Think I found us a trail. Uh, did I miss something?
Only that Joshua didn't. I don't get it. Thanks, Oji Chronic. I appreciate Always it, dude. wanted to visit Ash. Thanks, man. We're in Waluda territory now. Don't expect a warm welcome. Oh, I don't know, Clive. That castle over there looks inviting enough. Shall we sample its inhabitants' hospitality? Okay, let's check it out. Remember what I said about warm welcomes, Gav? <sighs> This place is as dead as Grieger's ghost. I knew I smelled something. I see only orcs and castles here. Let's hope the villagers made it out in time. Is it actually like for real way too dank? It's Camber all over again. Where the hell are the royalists? Seems you were right about that welcome after all, Clyde. <sighs> well, weird, sorry. It's too funny. Delegation. We should send a warning to the others. No. My uncle will have an eye on the coast. I trust he'll find a way to entertain any uninvited guests. Our mark is Drake's spine, and there's a lot of road between us and it. We press on to stone here. To stone here! Aye, you never know. It might not be an Estes Labyrinth monsters. <sighs> Clive, you must go on ahead without me. This stronghold is as old as Phoenix Gate, perhaps older. It may yet hide Ultima's remaining secrets, and if we are to best him, they must be unearthed. All right. Stay out of trouble. I always do, mostly. Share about this. About leaving my brother on his own. Of course. Mostly. Death flag? Yeah, another death flag. Lady Vivian's map is so old, it's hard to tell which way is up. But if I'm right, we're not far from a village called Eastler. Then we make our way there, resupply, and wait for Joshua. That wasn't letting me. Here we go. Next cutscene. What do you think, Clive? Then we're too late. Damn it. They're all turned. There's 
nothing we can do. I wouldn't say nothing. No quarter, Gav. No quarter. Okay. Big ignition. here soon. Actually, you ready? Here's the big gun. Roll the wipes. Limit break. Sick. Dude, didn't even finish the combo and he just died. Uh-oh. Oh, 
Rising Flame wind up. Damn! 48,000 damage! Big Perry! Roll the likes into this! Permafrost times two! Deadly Embrace pulling him down. Ignition! Huge, big wind up is the kill. Woo! Dude, we wrecked him, dude. We absolutely wrecked him, dude. Oh my gosh. Insane, dude. Alien level, nice. Gav? Gav! Don't tell me there's more of the bastards. Oh, fuck. Odin. He's back. Have you come to watch, Odin? Odin likes to watch. Bound for stone here. Good. My master awaits you in the capital, though I cannot allow you to attend him in your present state. And how are you going to stop us? Why, with this! What is that? What did you do? Would you mind telling me what the fuck just happened? <laughs> uh, oh, you've got to be. Well, that's How not good. Are we supposed to get through that? We seek an audience with the king. If his majesty wants me to come and ask him, then that is exactly what I'll do. Before you go practicing your petition, we don't even know where the fucker went. How about we cool our heads and think this through, eh? Maybe there's something here we can use. I saw 
we got them all. So did I. Tap it from the inside. Turned, all right. Who? Expecting mother? Her mother or someone else's? <laughs> I'm not turned. <laughs> Getting turned, bro. But what went on here? It all started when the skies changed. The elders said it was the Arche. One by one, the people went mad. Minds taken by either. The heck? Till only I remained. By then, I was too far alone to run. And, and then the nights came. And I didn't know what to do. And this, uh, okay. Is <laughs> just a story. Is he in the room with us right Something now? Grandparents told him <laughs> when we met the sound like his <laughs> about how the heavens would grow dark before the land took her last breath. The end of the world. You said the others went mad. But where did they go? They all left. The moon east to the tower, to Reverie. The elders, the healer, the blacksmith, my husband. Wait, what? You thinking he did this? Of course. Who else could it be? You were in Canva. You saw what he did to the people. Then what about yeah, her? her husband. How come her nut hasn't cracked? <clears throat> the baby, perhaps? Could be protecting her from the ether. I can't think of any other explanation. You mean... it's a bearer? It won't matter what it is once Ultima's I magic think... takes hold. Time's running out. What if the baby is a dominant? This tower. That's where we'll find the king. I knew it. It's the same as Phoenix Gate. <laughs> Which means that the end of these stairs should be.
The mural is complete. Ultima and his vessel, Ifrit. Garuda, Ramu, Shiva, Titan, Muhammad, Odin. Where is the Phoenix? So this isn't Ultima, this is Ifrit. This is Ifrit and the Phoenix combined. the founder so there's see dude see we knew see we said that earlier <laughs> so that's what you want isn't it ultima So when they saw this banner earlier, they said that it's Ultima at the top, but it wasn't Ultima at the top. It was Ifrit and Phoenix fused together, which is what we said. We said that looks well, kind of like Ifrit and Phoenix, be, not Ultima. I'm not asking, Gav. I need you to stay with Ed. That's crazy. What? I must do this alone. If I don't return, you're to find Joshua and make for the Enterprise. Understood? Yeah, and Ultima is inside of Joshua. Aye. Just don't you go dying on me. Sid's name suits your miserable mug better than mine. Don't worry. I haven't finished with it yet. Well, here's the thing. He called Leviathan, Leviathan the Lost. Did you guys notice that? Call on, Gina won't let me. I think it'll let me once I get out of town. You deserve a rest. What is this? Adamantite gauntlets? Did I just randomly find a legendary item or something? Increases max HP by 500? Dang. Here we go. Are you finishing today, This Pelican? is it, boy. This is it. All right. We're getting right into it, dude. What percent are you into the game so far? I, I think I'm like 85% or something. Okay, so ready? Next part, we're going to the Reverie. ground. It does gotta look like ice ground. Stay close.
Okay, here we go. Dude, I have a feeling this is gonna be nuts. The tower. It's alive. Oh, here we go. <sighs> Bloody fallen. Why do all their floors seem to have a mind of their own? Oh, no. through the gauntlet. Oh, frick. Big permafrost, will the likes, lightning rod, big ignition, big gouge. Right off the bat, dude. Big frostbite. Another wall of likes. Big frostbite. Ignition. Lightning rod. Dang. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh. Dude, I got so out of rhythm, man. I got so out of rhythm. Okay, I still killed him in the stagger. Oh, I got so out of rhythm, dude. I was doing so much damage, and I was just like, uh, 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 uh. I still railed him, dude. Still railed him. That was crazy. What was that thing? That was a I joke. Anymore. I wonder if it is straight up too easy, or is it? Did I just find out the? Did I just come up with the OP build? Is that what happened? I am. I am. I've freaking mastered the combat in this game. I think it'll be easy for me. New game plus is called Final Fantasy mode. Final Fantasy. The last one.
Death Star. It's go time. Okay, this thing is kind of hard, man. I can't get, I can't get a rhythm going. Okay, that's a big gouge. Big gouge, lightning, roll of the likes. Big wind up. Frick, I was trying to cold snap it. Okay, ready? Okay, now here's the big man. Get ready. Gouge. Oh, wait. I canceled my wind up with a limit break? Oh, I didn't know I could do that. I mean, it's okay. I still did a ton of damage. Here, frostbite, 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 frostbite dodge. Roll the likes. Ignition. Big gouge. Precision dodge. Phoenix shift, rising flames. Cold snap. Yeah! Is this harder than an Elden Ring? No, no. It's a completely different style. Again. Who's this? What's one more, eh, Toggle? The Orm Giant. Nice permafrost. Lightning rod, will of the wikes. Precision dodge times two. Rising flames. Oh, 
Pull him down, half stagger. Got a limit break in there. Big permafrost, time to pull the likes. Ignition. Precision. Phoenix ship. A little bit of frostbite. Frostbite again. Okay, I'm gonna go Will of the Likes. Lightning Rod. Ignition. Nice. He's dead. 100% right here. Thousand stagger damage, dude. Flying ignition. Down thrust. Yeah. Arm giant dismantled. Hell yeah. Look at that, dude. Dude, the combos are so freaking sick in this game, man. They really are. The combos are so sick. Is it possible to lose a fight? Not if your name is S. Two deaths. I did not die. Those are not real. Dude, I was testing. I've never died in Final Fantasy. Almost there. Can I go? He's here. I can feel him. I can feel him. Can I go jump Phoenix ship cold snap? No. You still recoil afterwards. I was wondering if I can go like do do do. I'm like. Tch -tch -tch. The blade must ever feed if her edge is to remain keen. Watcha. What care you for these worthless creatures? They are nothing. Weak from the moment of their conception, ever longing for power not theirs to command, they turn unfailingly upon themselves. Like sheep. They roam in filthy flocks, eager to trample those few gifted a fleece of gold. Or that they might feel contentment with their pitiful existence. Prejudice and persecution, severance and strife, every earthly wrong springs from the malice in men's hearts. 
malice born of the pain and suffering that is free will. Its corruption is gnawed at your being from the very moment of your birth. You're wrong. It is no corruption. It is who I am. Every choice I make, right or wrong, gives me reason to carry on. And carry on I shall. Not as a puppet, but as a man. Which are you? <laughs> there was a time I too thought those the only choices. What? Long ago, God granted man the gift of magic. And with that gift did he build great civilizations. Yet over time, you can play in man lost sight of the gift's true meaning, stepping from the path of shared yeah, muted, prosperity sorry. to one of avarice. He abandoned his creator for sword and flame, and through his folly, beckoned the blight. Yet, there were those few who refused to turn their eyes from the heavens. And they prayed to God that he might lead them back to righteousness. And the Lord, he did answer. Before the worthy shall the gates of paradise open. And so did I spread my arms to the ether and cast my soul upon its gentle waters. I gave myself unto him. Proven, the Lord charged me thus. If your kind are to find salvation, they must be made to serve. <laughs> you see, paradise lies but a single step away. Could we only take it? Could we only leave our transgressions behind? For none save the pure of heart and mind may set foot in the new world. I will save us. But it all begins and ends with you. You are the key, Mythos. And with this humble offering shall I prove my faith once more. So you forsook your kingdom. You forsook yourself to serve. Tell me, how is that living? <clears throat> What you seek to provide is not salvation. It's anything but. Life is about always having a choice. Take that away, and we might as well be dead. Very well. Come then. Okay. Show us the strength of your will. It's not the strength of my will that should worry you. But the weakness of yours. I don't know what that means, man. Oh, frick, here comes Odin. So this is it? This is THE Odin fight? Are we doing THE Odin fight? Oh no, here we go. Oh wait, this isn't even the Odin fight, this is Barnabas. Prove it. This is your dodge. Harry. One of the likes. Frostbite. with the might of 
the god. Yes, this is dodge time too. It's like a man. Lord's measure. Dang, okay. okay we're gonna go limit break. Magic burst combo. Limit break combo, frostbite. Big permafrost. Roll the likes. Lightning rod. That was big, dude. That permafrost is so big. That set me up so good, man. Full snap from the frost. No, frost pop. Little lunge. Permafrost, lunge, pull the white, lightning rod. Okay, big. Ah, I can't see! Big parry ignite ignition. Woo! Oh, man, that feels so good, dude. God chose you to serve as his vessel. And you cling to this foolish notion of hope when there is none. Fuck. Desperate, are we? Odin. Did Barnabas? Did Odin get knocked out of Odin into Barnabas? You have been shown the power. Now you must follow it. I knew Odin is Barnabas, but I was saying like the form. Because how did he go back? He went from Odin back to Barnabas, which we haven't seen. I thought it was going to be in. I thought we were just about to have the icon fight. Big bro. 
Frostbite. Frostbite? Oh, I thought it should be. That was so close, dude. That should have been permafrost. That, oh, what? How is that not a permafrost? Whoa, likes. Okay, big, big. Look at the stagger. Look at the stagger ripping through him right now. Ignition. Big parry as well. Come on, the two are perfect. Full of likes. There we go. That's, that's a big Big gouge, rip through the stagger. into it. That cutscene, what is happening? I have no idea. Defeated. You admitted defeat the moment you turned your back on us. When you turned your back on the truth, Barnabas. We are not as weak as your God believes. Huh? Just like that. Wait, what? Wait, Tortle, what? Oh, oh my gosh. I thought Tortle died. Oh my gosh, dude, I thought Tortle died. Damn it. Just cut the whole building in half. We go effort mode. Okay, just got bitched. Dude, effort's getting rocked. dead. Oh my gosh, you killed Odin's horse. Could it be you have made a weapon of your weakness? <laughs> my 
My apologies. You are not the fool I took you for. I took his sword? And so it ends. No! Wait, what? <laughs> Mark Hamill? Don't tell me you are tired, Mythos! Your stubborn defiance has stirred my long becalmed heart, filling it with a joy that I have not known for generations! I had thought the tantalizing kiss of self-indulgence a dream forever out of reach. And now that its sweet ruin courses through my veins, I shall not be quick to relinquish it. Show me your work, Mythos, that I might revel in it! Uh, okay. Roll the whites. Lightning rod. Hold snap. Got the frostbite off. Okay, big gouge right here. Frick, man. Oh, he's going to the dog. Dude, I just wasted so many potions without trying to use the dog's abilities. No, that was so bad. I have no potions. I have barely any potions left. I was like, why is my dog in I was like, wait, I don't have the dog. Dude, oh my gosh. Roll the whites. Pull snap. Pull snap again. Lightning rod. Ignition. Rising flames? Oh my gosh, I got it. Okay. How have I suffered the disappointment of lesser rivals? No more. Great divide, not again. Salvation is come. Rejoice is our soul. Let me, okay, I'm gonna limit, I'm gonna right here. How do you know this thing will come? No proof have you. Magic burst, magic burst, magic burst, lightning rod into... I'm gonna re I'm gonna reset my lightning rod, I'm gonna gouge him again with the lightning going off. And the potion. Precision dodge. Phoenix shift. Gold snap, frostbite. Good frostbite there. Stun near, frostbite. Come on, there is. Limit break. Roll the white. Okay, so we get a big stagger here. Wind up. Rising flames. Like. 
get gouged into the lightning rod? Oh, God. Did I get caught? Dude, it got blocked again. Okay, see, that should have run. The all wielder. Dude, this is actually taking like some serious consumes. I also blew like all my consumes at once on accident. Okay, uh, we're gonna go Lionheart Elixir to get our limit gauge up. Our strength tonic. I should have done this already. Okay. Wait, what the heck? It, it, it lasted so little. Wait, what? That lasted so little? It staggered? Limit break. Permafrost? Oh, that's huge permafrost. That is a massive permafrost, dude. Forgive me. Frick! Oh, I went for the windup. I, I was thinking about pausing to heal, dude. I had an elixir. Frick, man. I burned all my heals at the beginning. No, man. Oh. Dang, dude. Oh, I thought about pausing to heal, man. I had the elixir. I just burned. At the beginning of the fight, I was like spamming my buttons. Like, why is my dog not fighting? And I realized I didn't have the dog. So I was just burning my potions. And I was like, no. Oh, actual real death, dude. Actual real death. So 
I was like not paying attention. Like in my head, I was like, this fight's so long, it's gonna suck starting over from the beginning, but it's actually worse. Like I actually, I actually don't like that it, uh... It's, it basically only starts you over from like, part way through the fight. So thank you though, for real. Yeah. Big wind up is the kill. Nice, okay. At an end. And we both know the truth. It is I who stand victorious. My will that prevailed. Your will? No. It was his. Clive Rossfield. Dodge! Damn! Precision counter! Dark Shard, Magic Ash. <laughs> Wait. Did I fall him down? Strength in will. Would that I had not relinquished my own. <laughs> you relinquished nothing. What was it, if not will, that made you strive for a new world? Strive to win your master's approval? Shown a fantasy, and you chose to believe it. But you were wrong. There is no world but the one we live in. And that world, that world is worth saving, even if it means killing a god. Words. 
from one who has served the Lord so well. This is pointless. But I almost forgot. <laughs> Why won't you die? I promised that I would make you presentable. Did I not? Wait, what? So he's not even absorbing him. We shall he's like forcing himself destinies. to be absorbed? Just as the Lord's Mother Crystals have fulfilled theirs. Come, Clive Rossfield. Take what is rightfully yours. Become one with God. No. At long last, salvation. I'm coming home. Whose mother? Genova? Tell me, how does it feel? Ultima? Show yourself! Face me! How does it feel to consume your rival's strength? To gorge yourself on their being? To edge step by trembling step ever closer to the divine? With or without a will, you are still but a vessel, our vessel. Behold, how your body shudders in anticipation of its fate. Oh, it's not yours yet. No. Come then, O oh wayward child. We shall await you upon the back of the first worm. There all shall end and begin again. Okay. <laughs> hey, B. Why the hell is my city going with a 
nothing. Don't ask me, ask them. Since when was Eugen Hamel one to hide when there was a fight to be had? Since they stripped me of my rank and banished me from Hamel? the battlefield. Now I'm stuck driving the backsides of this one while the city burns and my wife tells off the man half my age. And then you turn up. What the hell are you doing here anyway? What indeed? <laughs> The enemy numbers 200,000 or more counting yours. There are simply not enough soldiers counting in the capital to repel an army of that size. Then one of the central keep, held by a contingent of soldiers and bearers from the surrounding boroughs. They are the sole reason it still stands. And all it took was an army on their doorstep to bring them together. The prospect of death does put things into perspective. <laughs> yeah, perspective. Perhaps it's what we've lacked all along. Dude, oh no, I haven't been about. Dude, I really hope Uncle Byron doesn't die. He's such a good character. Some of your best men, preferably all of them. My best men? Does it look like I'm anymore? I admit this might not be the most convenient time, but my nephew's in trouble. And I pray you've already promised him your help. Your nephew, the outlaw. My soldiers have better things to do than die for nothing. And you and he are of the same mind. I fight for the opposite. He fights for a world in which he shouldn't have to live and die for nothing. And, and he fights today to give us all the chance of a better tomorrow. Be that as it may, a handful of men cannot stand against the kingdom. <laughs> And mayhap they are the wrong men. Wait, what? Be damned. Our numbers are few, but I shall the dragoons. The dragoons as I'm able. You, apprise the Lord Strategist of the state of the city's defenses. Yes, Your Radiance. And you would fight alongside us. I owe the Phoenix a debt. <laughs> Does this vouch for my nephews? Aye, but I still have my doubts about you. Which we can discuss later. Indeed. You said you had men garrisoned in the keep. Captain, do you know how many yet remain? Allow me to confirm. Commander? Whatever their number, Randalar will be needing Gather the them the bodies all. and build a pyre in the courtyard. Quickly. Terence. My lord. You will find a girl there. A girl? We are in the middle of a war. I owe her my life, and I always pay my debts. You are to see that she is provided for. <laughs> Dion, I cannot leave. You <laughs> shall. <laughs> the way it's like, a girl, if now. If I to be worthy of the forgiveness <laughs> of our people, then I must earn it. His best. And I must earn it by my hand, and my hand alone. No, that I do not ask this by me. <laughs> and know that I will do it. Farewell, Terence.
It's not an army invading the city. They're uh, a Kashik. Basically, the ether they got infested by infected by the ether, and then uh, it makes them turn it turn like that, turn like evil like that. Clive, thank fuck, you all right? I am. But I'm a damn sight better for seeing you, Joshua. And Barnabas. The king is dead. Dang. Thanks, Pill. Yeah, it's been really good, dude. So, so there. They are, but so is their killer. He can't hurt anyone anymore. You're safe. Talk drama. I'm sorry, Clive. You know I want nothing more than to go with you. I do. But I'm glad you're heading back to the Enterprise nonetheless. And not just for Edda's sake. Our people need to know what happened here. You can count on me. As can she, I hope. Thank you, me lords. <clears throat> Milady? Do you think that was wise? Wiser than leaving a woman with child alone in the Deadlands. They'll be safer at the hideaway. For now, at least. This land is overrun with Akashic. <laughs> the king himself was long turned, albeit by choice, all to serve Ultima in his damnable quest to forge the perfect vessel. The chaos Barnabas wreaked upon nation after nation. How many were killed for this? Ah. Oh, he didn't consider it killing. Or a... Mercy of sorts. A way to end their suffering. He truly wanted to save mankind. And ultimately use that. <sighs> As he uses us. Why us? What are we? What are we? That is our fate. But that doesn't mean we have to accept it, which is why we fight. For the right to deny it. Is that not so? It is. Barnabas said something else. That the Mother Crystals were Ultimas. Ultimas? Are you certain? We know. 
know that the Mother Crystals have been leading the land of Ether. And we also know that it's this which hastens the spread of the Blight. But what I cannot fathom is what Ultima stands to gain from that. What did you find at the Stronghold? The truth about Ultima's prize. For so long, I believed it to be you, and you alone. Yet, it is not merely a freed that he desires, but a freed and phoenix both. That which we became in the skies over Twinside. Only when the twin flames are joined, shall his vessel be complete. Quite why he needs a vessel is another question. Unless there is something he cannot achieve without one. Something his immaterial form precludes. Something requiring an unthinkable amount of ether and a body resilient enough to channel it. If I did not know better, brother, I would think that he meant to cast a spell a spell a thousand years in the making. A spell to end all spells. And he cannot do it without us. Nor without the Mother Crystals. But if we destroy them all, we will stop not only the Blight, but Ultima as well. We stick to Daughters. the plan then. Only this time, we face him together. Well, Ultimer. It's a long walk to stone here. Let's not keep Ultimer waiting. Power of Darkness. Clive has climbed a portion of the icon Odin's Essence. Attuning with Odin not only changes the elemental aspect of Clive's magic spells, but also allows access to several new iconic abilities such as Gungnir. The feat is Arm of Darkness. Can we use to temporarily transform Clive's weapon into Odin's legendary blade, landing attacks to charge the blade, running it for uh, Zentetsuken. That's a Street Fighter again? Which is executed by holding square. Zen Tetsuken potency is determined by the blades charged at the time of the execution. When Barnabas fell, his magic died with him. The road to stone here is barred to us. No. Okay. There it is, dude. We finally have all icons unlocked. All right. Oh, there we have it. We have now unlocked. All the icons, we have all the icon abilities. Uh, I guess we can have any of the icon abilities, right, if you reach back and stuff, but we, we've unlocked all the icons. Uh, we have Shiva, we have Odin. This is probably gonna be the second to last video. I, I would assume there's probably gonna be one more after this, now that it has all the icons. I think given that we have all the icons here, uh, it's probably looking close to, to finishing up. But yeah, I mean, I, I think, uh, I think the Odin battle was insane. I think the Odin fa fight was insane. Uh, you know, we got Shiva's powers. Uh, I, I think the game's really setting up to um, basically finish out here pretty soon. Uh, a lot of people are saying New Game Plus is, uh, a lot of people are saying New Game Plus is pretty good. Um, it's, it's pretty difficult and it actually changes some of the encounters. So, you know, maybe as far as stream goes, maybe I'll play a little bit of extra to do a little bit of like New Game Plus stuff uh, after. I, uh, after I finish the game, but I'm not sure. But, uh, yeah, I mean, that's it for the Odin fight. That's it for getting all the icons, and I think we're, we're gonna be preparing to finish out the game. So, if you guys liked this YouTube video, if you guys like the stuff I do here, uh, make sure to sub to the YouTube channel. Make sure to sub to the YouTube channel. Check me out live on Twitch, Discord, SFAN TV. Everything is SFAN TV. YouTube, Twitch, Discord, Twitter, Instagram. What? What is happening? Power of the light. That's my hand.